Good evening, everybody. How's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some RuneScape, shall we? Well, apparently, while we're kind of waiting for everyone um, to get here... Good evening, Episcicat and Nickman. Uh, Nickman has offered to help me set up the ribbon a little bit, and... Um, explain the chats and I think I do need a bit of help with the interface because it still confuses me so um let's see I think I am in the right place for that to happen um there we go Nick man I'm in the channel with you um can you hear me Yes, I can. Excellent. Can everyone hear Nick? I hope so. I can. Sir Theodore, <laughs> good evening. How you doing? So, um, Nick, man, what would you like to help me with first? Uh, your ribbon, the thing on the bottom right. Uh-huh. The thing on the bottom right, right of your interface. Uh, it's kind of a mess. <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, so you mean with all the buttons? Yeah, uh, most of the buttons are either not useful or they're just too many. Okay, okay. Okay, uh, I'll show you how I do it. Okay. And then you can add the buttons you like. Okay, great. So uh, there's a little uh, cog uh -huh. for setting it up. Okay. Just click on that. Neo, good evening. Okay, I see it. I'm on settings okay. here, Nick Man. So these are all the things you can put in there. Okay. I like having only a few of those, uh, and though uh, the data music collapse into the others. Ah, okay. That makes okay. sense. So the ones I like using is the hero button. It's the sword with shield. Okay, the sword with the shield that is down here. Um, or... It's in the man management windows. Oh, oh, this one here. Okay, uh-huh. And you, okay. Uh huh. Well, for now, I'd say just remove everything. Clear all. Except the settings. <laughs> okay. All right. There we go. Okay. Now I've got the Let's hero. Clean it up. Yeah. Okay. So everything that's in management, I'd say, is useful to put in. Okay. Hero. Because everything that's in management, uh, you they collapse into the stuff that's in action. I see. Okay. And do you put the settings there, or do you just go? through the cog to get there i usually put the settings there or you can press escape both are useful. okay okay all right all right okay. now we have eight so, so like this you can have access to everything ah. now if you uh, get out of there okay so just say um close it okay take a little time to uh click on each one of them to know what they do to see what they collapse into so Okay, perfect. Yes, Sir Theodore, you're right. Emotes. I need to have emotes, like, as the most important hotkey. Okay, so under Hero, I can get my skills, I can get my backpack, worn equipment, achievement paths, activity yeah, track. Achievements is super useful for account progression if you want to do that on another stream. <laughs> yeah, I think you were... Um, I know. I love doing the jig, Neo. You're right. I, I think you were telling me about that before, about how like each area has achievements that just unlock certain features for you, which sounds awesome. Um, yeah. Okay. The wilderness unlocks a very useful sword. Uh, RD uh, unlocks uh, a very useful teleport and stuff like that. Oh, now I'm seeing it. Okay, so I see what you're saying, Nick, man. So, like, the one of the things I was worried about is, like, well, I like to go to my prayer and my spells from oh, a ribbon, there. but they're right here in powers. So exactly. I can get to familiar prayer spells and... If, if you click on the magic book, for example. Uh-huh. Yeah, there it, it is. Got it. And now you have access to all your abilities. Perfect. Which up your bar and stuff like that. That's awesome. Okay, and then, you know, quests, yes. Um, and then this is all the social stuff. Oh. Yak tracker. What is, like, yeah. I've never seen this metrics, graphs, and drops. Try it. Okay, metrics. 
Oh, wow. So you could just find your, like, experience per hour and stuff? Yeah, Interesting. I like to have that uh, just besides the, uh, beside the map. Wow, yeah. so you can just kind of just... Window. So you just have your own little window here where you can see, like, how much of whatever skill I'm going for, like how efficient I'm being or something. That's yeah. interesting. And I usually put a medic, make it a little smaller. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Wow. God, that's crazy. I didn't even know that existed. All right, cool. So now you can access much more easily everything. <laughs> Perfect. All right, that that is a much tidier looking yeah. ribbon there. Okay, great. Okay. Uh, next, do you want to kill five more moles? Yeah, we can do that. Um, does anybody in chat right now, does anybody want to kill any moles with us? I'm in the right place. I he Is it because if I kill five more, I get a teleport? Is that what you were saying? Exactly. Okay, yeah, we can do that easily. Does anybody... Hey, hey, what's up, cowboy? Good evening. Anybody wants to, we are on world one. I don't know how big the party size can be for this, but we're on world one and we can kill some moles. Pretty much infinite. Infinite? That's awesome. Any like Perfect. Anybody want to come over? Let's do this. Ooh. Okay. Uh, before you go into the mall, uh, don't forget to ask Death for an assignment. Oh, okay. Perfect. Um, and just as a side note, would you guys recommend getting the botanist boots, or are they not really that great? They're really useful. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Let's just put them in the bank. Great. Um, and let's just open another chest. Um, ooh, adamant bars. Well, that might be useful for, uh, you know, leveling up smithing or something. Or is that just, should I just use protean and not even worry about it? Well, if you want to make, uh, some, uh, Oh, adamant, a uh, gear. Stuff. Okay, some sure. Gear. Might, might as well. I'll probably need it for a quest or something too, anyway. Botanist outfit is I like... I need some for, uh construction uh, construction contracts for uh construction xp oh okay sir theodore thank you for explaining that okay good point neo all right then fair enough all right that makes a lot of sense okay so let's just um backpack that and then um um i'll bank these dummies and one more oh a thousand protean logs now you're talking all right um, we'll put those in the bank. I love the, the logs. Okay, perfect. Got my thieving up a little bit there. Actually, um, while we're waiting for anybody who wants to... and Oh, I need to go back to Draenor and talk to Death. Is that what you said before we kill the moles? Yeah. Okay, let me just do that. While I'm doing that, everybody, I am curious. Um, you know, I want to have a chat window where it's like I can see friends chat... But I can also see the global chat. Is that a thing? Yeah. Uh, go in settings. Okay. The cog. Yeah. Uh, in messages and social. Oh, oh, you mean this? Okay, messages and social. And uh, I can't remember where to split the chat. Split private chat. Uh, no, not private. Is um. it? I can't remember. But, uh, say, get out of there. <laughs> okay, not in... Okay. If you're in uh, the world chat, the one with the uh, planet... Yes, I am. Okay. Uh, you see there are icons that are grayed out? Right. I have French chat on, right? Okay, so it, right now, if I write in French chat... I can see it. Like, I can see what Neo said here. You can see it. Yeah. So you can see the normal chat and the French chat at the same place. But if I want to talk in French chat from global mm -hmm. chat, can I do that? Yes. Uh, press enter. Uh-huh. Okay, so slash press... And your message. Did you say enter and then slash? Uh, well, the, you... Too many enters. Oh, okay. Enter... Backspace. <laughs> slash... Like that? Is that what you said? Yep. And okay. then your message. Did that work? Um, or did I type the wrong kind of slash? Um, yes, it works. Oh, but I don't... Oh, no, there it is. I see it. Great. Yay. Okay, now I'm getting it. Now I'm getting it. Oh, everybody. Thank you so much for 
being so uh, <laughs> patient with me as I try to understand all of this stuff. That was frustrating me forever that, like, I would see people talk in friends chat, and then I would talk, like, I wouldn't know how to do that, and I would just toggle over to the friends chat window, but then I would miss global information. So when you get into a group chat or a, a clan chat, you uh -huh. just add more slashes. So if you, uh, two slashes is the clan chat, four is the group chat, three is the guest clan chat. Okay. More slashes, I see. So I, I should just ask him for another assignment? Yep. Okay. I need an assignment. Four souls from, he and wants four. So maybe, did we kill it six times? He wants four from the giant. Uh, we did it five times last time. So okay. we'll do one more than uh, what he's asking. All right, great. So I said, sure thing. And then now I just go back to, um, was I in Varric or? Falador. Falador. Oh, Falador. Shoot. That's right. That's right. In the garden. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to do something. What's up, crispy bacon? I'll be doing almost no damage this time. It is an insane knife, um, Crispy. It's like a cleaver. I was expecting more of like a uh, like a paring knife or something. Oh my gosh. So you're going to do no damage, Nick Man? Almost no. <laughs> I'll be just using defensive to tank, but you're going to be doing most of the damage. And I'm going to help you with uh, the mechanics. Okay, great. You get to notice everything. <laughs> okay. Um, hey, cowboy, no worries. Um, are you in Falador with us, or where are you at? Yeah, I'm at the bank. Okay. I'm just getting some food. I've got some blubs. Uh, damn, this account has almost no food. Uh, you want? Can I give you some blubs? Well, I've got sharks. Okay. And I'll be using defensive, so I might, I'm most likely not even going to need food. Hey, hey look, it's okay. a Pisca Cat. He, you're here, Kit Brecker. Sir Kit Brecker, indeed. Awesome. I can, uh, the maximum players is 16. Okay. Well, I see, um, not 16. So we should be doing great. <laughs> so I'm in. My name is PX Zero. Oh, you're already in um, down there. Okay, perfect. Yep. So I click on here, and then I say join, and then I just need to join um, PX uh, Zero. Think like that. All right, a Pisca Cat. If you want to join, uh, click join, and then type. Um, PX0 on the mole, and you should be in here, theoretically. Oh, well, I didn't bring prayer, but doesn't matter. Anybody else wants to join? Um, hey, there's a Pisca Cat. Awesome. We're down here, and the mole is down here, too. Okay, so what should I do? So, for now, uh, oh, you're Melly? Uh, I, that's what I was last time, yeah, because okay. from the Dragon Slayer, so, you know. Are you dual wielding? Or? Yes, I am. I am dual wielding. Good. So right now I'm going to attack. You attack after, and you try to uh, do as much DPS as you can. Okay. One second. It, I think it's uh, um... right now. Your abilities look decent, but uh, uh, going to your melee abilities. Uh huh. Okay. So melee abilities. Uh huh. Uh, just let me check what. Thresholds? Do you uh, have access to? I've got. Um... You have. Uh... Uh, in strength. Oh. Do you I... have access to uh, one to the right, one down. In strength. Uh, destroy. Yeah. Um, it, it's there. Yeah, I can do it. Seven strength. Um, do I have 37 strength? Yeah, I do. I have that. Yeah, so drag that into your bar. Okay, they got it. Cool. Okay. Uh, next, do you have anything else you can use? 
And the furthest on the right, the second sc down. The assault? Yeah. Do uh, you have the levels for this? I do not. It takes 55 okay. strength. So for now, uh, pretty much the best action bar you can have. <laughs> So, uh, whenever you you have the adrenaline, use your two threshold abilities, and you should be fine and do enough damage. Okay, so I actually can't use debilitate right now. I'll just take it out of my bar um, because it takes too much defense. Um, oh, that didn't actually remove it, but anyway, whatever. Um, you ready? Uh huh. Let's, Let's go for do this. It. Attack him. Okay. Okay, Neo. I'm sorry. Thank you for uh, trying. I'm so new to this like multiplayer thing. All right. So I have um, all of my abilities. Now you see how the mold do uh, dove into the ground. Uh huh. There were arrows uh, pointing to where she was going. Oh, I see. Yes. Run. Hit it. Now, is this where I want to be hitting the small ones? Yep. They increase your defense. Okay. Yeah, that's the, that's the shame about Iron Man is that, like, we can't all play together because I am not Iron. I'm, like, the opposite of Iron. I'm Tin Man. <laughs> Iron Man can uh, play together, but they can't really play with main accounts. Oh, she's attacking you. You can just move back a bit so I can uh, provoke her. Okay. All right, now she went this now way, I guess. Up. Yeah, you got it. Okay. I see. All right, let's get her. In this room, she's going to dive down into the ground, make a little earthquake that damages over time. Okay. Like uh -oh. this. Okay, and we just run? Yeah, just run out of the earthquake thing. Okay. Now, where did she go? This way. Um, I thought. Oh, Theodore. Hello? <laughs> oh, there's Sir Theodore, yep. Oh, I had it wrong. There she is. Now we've got a rockin' party. Now we need to stun her before she deals a lot of damage. Okay, um, I got my backhand, I guess. Yeah. And she's gone. Okay, and then she's going this way, I see. Okay, cool, this is fun to learn the Theo, mechanics. There's 70 weapons. <laughs> so... At what point do you think this is soloable? Like, what would uh, my... When you have level 50 stats. Okay. Uh, oh, I forgot to tell you to put freedom and anticipate into your bar. When, we, when we're done with that one, uh, you go into your defensive abilities. And we can get you something cool. By something useful. <laughs> oh, yeah, cowboy. Y you can definitely catch me. I am the slowest RuneScape player you'll meet. Okay, we got to stun it. Exactly. Get it. She's got her balance back, but not before I do my threshold attack. Wow, I hit for her. Like I th well, actually, I can't tell if that's my damage or somebody else's damage, honestly. But I'm going to pretend like it's mine. <laughs> Uh, you can uh, change the colors uh, of the hit splats oh, to okay. different, depending on if it's you or someone else. Cool. Well, for now, defensive abilities. Okay, so you were saying I can put some more abilities up here that I need. Yeah. Um. All right. So you were saying go to defensive abilities, okay, and then put in like uh, siphon in sight. Oops. Uh, Oh, the shield. Instead okay. of the heart, the shield. Uh-huh. Anticipation. Okay. And freedom. 
those prevent stuns. Uh, don't put them in, in the, your main bar. Put it in your secondary bar. Oh, okay, They're okay. Gotcha. No matter the style. Okay, cool. So, remove stuns and, and binds. Oh, nice. And the best would be to keybind it to something uh, you can get to uh, easily. Okay, so... Um, customize keybind... All right, great. There we go. For me, there those two are on my mouse. Oh, I see. Should There's I attack six. it again? I'll do it, and let's, let's go. do it. Let's go, everybody. Oh, I forgot to bring Excalibur. We, Thanks, Gil. We did it, Kit Brecker, Sir Kit. It's great to have you, you guys, all here. This is hilarious. All right. So, you're telling me that this is a, a multiplayer game. No, I'm just joking. It's a... I've been playing it, like, you know, single-player quest for so long. Oh, cool, Pisca Cat. You do it. We'll take care of the mole. My whip cracks will, anyway. All right, let's get this mole. I see it. This is a dumb question, but you can surge at any time. You don't have to be using like a magical setup. Anytime. Awesome. Oh, I got some... My daily combat is flying up. It must be like... Kill moles. No, it's not, but... As long as the area allows for it, I see. Gotcha. Alright. And... I'm gonna get you with my threshold. This isn't the phase when we stun it, right? It'll say, like, the creature looks like it's about... It can be stunned or something, and that's when yeah. we want to do it? Okay. This room is where you use freedom or anticipate. Ah, if you get stunned by the earthquake or whatever? If you get stunned, it's freedom. If you, uh, Before you get stunned, anticipate. I just did it. I just freedomed out of that. Sweet. I don't know if that was the right thing, but I was I was getting hit by rocks on my head. Yeah, basically the updated moles so that uh, people understood abilities like uh, freedom and anticipate. I see. Before so it, it was uh, just a big damage dummy that had almost no HP, so it was kind of boring. You could just crush it, I see, and now you have to kind of learn your skills. It can be stunned, get it. Yeah. I'll provoke it. Uh-oh. I gotta eat. Oh my god, I've died. I lose. Can I... That, uh... Can I get back there? Most likely. <laughs> well, yeah, of course. But do I have to get the quest again from death? No. Okay. You can die as many times as you want. All right. Well, that's a shame. I gotta pay attention to my health more. I wasn't taking damage before. Um, all right. I was looking at, like, my stun and forgot about my health. Hey, hey. Yeah. What's up, Ragnarsson? I know, I didn't make it. I, uh, I got greedy. Come over here. Why does he want me to go over there? I gotta talk to him? Yeah, to get your gear back. Oh, okay. I wondered why I was in my preliminary stuff. Greetings. Pleased to meet you. I'm glad to see you taking this so well. Most of the recently deceased are more upset. Fortunately for you, it's not yet your time. Great. How do I get back? Death will not claim you yet. Right. Thanks. When you die, you lose your items. I lose my stuff? Yeah, this is my first time dying in the game. So I've never seen this. I don't even know. I, I'm, like, confused. Like, why am I here? Um... 
Yes, however, these items can usually be recovered. A gravestone will appear where you died. Reaching it will allow you to reclaim your items yourself. Otherwise, I am able to recover many items, but my service comes at a cost. Do be careful, too. If you die without reclaiming your original items, I won't be able to help. Oh, you can buy a ring of life on the GE to teleport out right before you die? Does it just automatically do that for you or something? Yes, uh, but... Uh... Uh, well, it can be useful, yeah. It, it's like a uh, a fairy in Zelda. Okay, you can see the items you will drop, which will be lost and which will be kept, and the items kept on death interface in your worn inventory. I see. Whenever you die with items that you could drop, you can purchase the items back from death for a small portion of their value. But if the boss hits you a lot, it might not activate it in time I see you may also attempt to reclaim them from your gravestone but beware dying again may cause you to lose everything oh gosh I'll now show you what you re could reclaim for me you may return at any time to reclaim these alright so he's basically saying like most of this stuff I can get and then he's saving my luck of the dwarves thank you exactly. if, um, it, if he hadn't saved the luck of the dwarves it would be like uh, 700,000 to reclaim items. <laughs> Yikes. I see. Um, so, should I just pay for this, or should I just go back to my grave? Is it going to be, like, right at the entrance to the mole, or actually right where I died? Should be at the entrance. Okay, so, um... Uh, I have a lot of money. I guess it's just safer just to buy it. Um... I don't know. What would you guys do? I'm new to this whole death thing. Uh, since I have high level stuff, I usually buy my stuff because uh, when you unlock invention, uh, you they drain if you get stuff from your gravestone. Oh, I see. And draining is uh, like an hour of uh, training, uh, getting energies from divination. Huh. All right. Um, I would like to respawn in Faldor.